Hey guys, it's me, Talia. Um, thumbs up, thumbs down if you like my channel. Um, if you are new here, please hit subscribe. If you're not, hi. Sorry, I'm very down right now. <laughs> I know you guys can all tell that. Why is Talia so down right now? What happened? So I recently um, got really upset and I got yelled at at one of my friends who goes to work with me, like program stuff. And apparently, my friend is no longer my friend. So I want to talk, until I get this conversation, I want to talk to you guys, friendship, loyalty, and how to be nice to your friends, how to, you know, get along with them, and whatnot, because I'm actually gone pretty much a tough day. I had to use my anxiety stuff, which is my oil, because I had anxiety attack, and I felt so upset i started crying i was just it was everywhere so i want to talk to you guys friendship loyalty and how to be nice and wanting each other okay so my story mine was a little long but i can tell you half of it my friend didn't like what i did i was concerned okay i were by my friends like everyone else you know in high schools you get so scared, you're like, oh my gosh, this person did this, what? You get concerned, okay? So it's normal to be concerned to your friends. It's normal to be upset. It is normal because you are a good friend, okay? You, I'm doing this, but I am a good friend, but you guys are too, sorry. Um, and you want to be there for your friend no matter what happens. Talk to them, see if they're okay, you know, whatever. So I asked my, my friend, okay, now... My friend said this to us when we were on FaceTime. I'm not going to say names, so I'm just going to tell you what happened. This person said that I'm depressed. My person is right next to me. Don't worry about it. And that was it. So tell me, is does that sound like you're concerned? If you're feeling depressed and your friend is there, you also want to be concerned too and see if you can help as well, right? Okay. So... My reaction was like, oh my gosh, is there everything okay? Can I help you? Whatever. This is, you know, a little bit scary. So I texted my friend say, hey, it's me, dot, 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 the name. Listen, I'm here if you need anyone to talk to. I'm here if you need any advice, any tips. I'm there when you need it. Let me know. I can talk to you, whatever. And now tell you this is a really awkward situation, okay? This is weird. The last text, or the second text that I said, and this is the person's text. What are you, jealous that I'm hanging out with this person or in, and I'm not hanging out with you? What? When you're saying on social media, on FaceTime with everybody with you, like teachers, whatever, you say you're depressed. I said, is everything okay, right? I said that... Can I help you with anything? Let me know. If you want to talk, that's cool. I can do that for you. I'm not, like, I am not very, like, jealousy person. I can be jealous if I feel like it. But I'm not jealous. If you guys are together, you guys are together. Okay? That's it. And I said, okay, well, I was just trying to be a good friend. And that person said, you are a good friend. It's just... I'm having some issues. And I'm like, okay, but it's making me more concerned. Say, is there anything I can do as a friend? So here's my situation. And here's what you guys can do. If you guys have this problem about trying to get your friends back or whatever, my problem, this is how I say it. <clears throat> when your friend, when you say to your friend or anyone, you're feeling depressed. That's a big thing because that means you're not feeling happy. You're feeling really, really um, not so good or... Sorry, I just had to see if anyone texted me. So that was my day recently. And I know you guys are saying, oh my gosh, Talia, are you okay though? That's all right. I'm fine. That's all right. But thanks for asking anyways. Um, but, you know, for friends... If someone is there and telling you that I'm here for you, how will you say, thank you, that's really kind of you, I will be okay, thanks. But the other side is like, what are you, jealous 
so I can read the text, but I'm not telling you the name or whatnot, okay? Because this, if you guys have friends problems, th this is how I feel. So on Tuesday, I said, hey, dot, 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 someone's name. You can always trust me if you want to. I mean, I was just kind of worried about you and dot. I'm like, this is a little weird, but okay, FYI, if you need to talk to anybody, I'm here. If you need it, whatever. Now, this is someone's respond. And I took this really in a bad way because it's like, this is a little bit stupid, I'm going to say. What's wrong? Are you jealous of me and dot dot being together? You're a good friend, but me and dot dot has other business. So... Okay, and I said, I'm just trying to be a good friend. Never mind. Fine, I'll back off. That's what I did. You are a good friend, but you are taking it too seriously. Okay. <clears throat> I'm not going to read to you guys everything because it, some things are personal. So, if your friend is becoming like this, you know what you do? Have a talk to them. If you have a parent's phone number or whatever... Talk to the parent about this because the parents are concerned and plus this is their children. So you want to say to them that you're concerned as well. That's all right. But people who are out there who are teenagers or adults or anybody having a really tough decision, it's okay. It is normal to be upset. It is normal to help other people. It is not, it is not normal to say to that person, what's wrong? You're jealous? That's a not okay. That's not normal because that makes you feel like, what did I do, right? So for you guys, and of course for me, I took it angry because I thought, what did I do wrong, you know? So for me, and take everyone's advice. If you guys have a friend who's not nice to you or whatnot, just if you have a boyfriend or a girlfriend you want to hang out with, maybe that take your mind off of it. That's good. That's really good. It's healthy. Or if you have anxiety and you have a oil, this is actually um, lavender or not lavender. I don't know. Some kind of oil. I don't know. It says right there. I don't know if you can read or not. <laughs> but I have that oil for my anxiety because I have it. Everyone has anxiety. Mine is more like, you know, private issues or whatever. So... I just felt very, very upset, concerned, hurtful, and felt like I thought I was there for you, but okay, you don't want to take it, that's cool, okay? But if your friend is saying that I'm there for you, that's an awesome friend. <coughs> that's a very awesome friend because you don't know. You know, you can't just have one or how many friends you can always have a lot of friends if you want one or two is not enough if you have a lot of friends then that's good but i just felt that was just hurtful and today was even more hurtful so my friend one of my so-called friends or not anymore yelled at me because i was into someone else's business of saying how they're doing or what they're doing in the future. Well, your friend can be curious. It's okay to be curious. It's okay to be worried about your friends. Everything the way you feel is normal. The way that they felt with the anger, it's not normal because it's like, that's a little bit mean, you know? So comment down below, what do you guys think? How, like, do you feel like you want to be friends with a person who is not very nice to you? Or how do you guys deal with it? Because, you know, I can give you guys tips or you can give me tips of how to calm down my anxiety <laughs> um, or anything else. It's just, I just thought this would be a good idea to talk about friendship, loyalty, how to be nice and how people should be nice to you more or whatever. Um, let me know down below what you guys think. And if you say to me, that's a really cool idea. And let me say this. If your friends are not being nice to you, don't worry. They will come back to you and they're, they're going to be so wrong the way they treated you. Because you 
and me and everyone shouldn't be treated the way that they are getting rude. Be treated the way you want to be treated. And that's it. Because it's not very nice. It's not respectful. It's very rude. So if you like this video, thumbs up, thumbs down. If you don't like this video, okay. Um, and please, no rude comments. I just, you know, ugh, too much everywhere. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.